Good day Libra and welcome to my channel. I'm Misha the Psychotic Psychedelic Gypsy and this is your weekly reading for October 16th to the 22nd. If you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well and I hope this reading resonates with you. Universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Nine of Diamonds. Two of Clubs. Ace of Spades. And the Six of Diamonds. So, your energy this week is confusion and feeling misled. Um, but the thing is, is that the confusion and the misled feeling that you're going to have all week, these are false. They're false. They're false confusions. Like, um, you know something, but now somebody's made you think that you don't know what you're talking about. And that's causing confusion. That That's kind of, you know, what's happening here. Same with the misled part. Uh, you're not really misled. You're just, you know, uh, confused, but not confused, you know. It's confusing. <laughs> but anyway, uh, whatever it is that, you know, you think you're confused of or you feel like you're misled, you need to just recheck your, your tracks, recheck your facts, recheck your tracks, go over everything because whatever it is that you feel like you're confused about or that you're misled by you're not you know what you you're talking about you know you know you know things you're not you're not stupid but somebody might be trying to make you feel stupid uh and they might you know talk to you in such a way where it confuses you and then you think that the answer that you did have isn't the correct answer uh you know, stuff like that. That's what's going to be happening throughout the whole week. You're going to be going through this uh, where you're feeling confused or misled. And I'm not saying that's always going to be uh, someone else making you feel this way. Uh, this can also be you. You might just like, maybe you've got so much work on your hands and, you know, you start thinking that you don't know what you're doing or whatever. We can do that to ourselves. Uh, and the cards just say, stop. Recheck your facts, recheck your steps, you know, you, you know what you're talking about. So when the confusion happens, when the misled happens, don't let it spiral into anxiety or a panic attack or whatever. Instead, stop for a minute and really, you know, check your steps, check your thoughts, check your memory. You know, you're not confused, you're not misled. It, it's false. Um, at the beginning of the week, uh, you're going to have a wish fulfilled through your hard work. Wealth and abundance is yours, uh, but you need to accept your worth. You need to accept your worth and know your worth. You know what? See, that's, maybe maybe there is somebody that's going to be trying to trip you up. Uh, I just have that feeling that there's somebody, you know, somebody that's not going to, uh, you know, doesn't want you to see your worth or understand your worth, you know. Um, and that would be through confusion that could be, you know, uh, through confusion by making you feel like you're confused about your worth, that you're confused about what you're capable of doing. Uh, that's not going to be for everybody, but I feel like for some of you out there, uh, somebody's going to actually be causing this to happen. Others of you, it might just be you causing it, uh, through worry, you know, worry deadlines it can be anything um but yeah it's false you need to know your worth and respect your worth and you need to make other people respect your worth um and accept it you know in the middle of the week uh you're going to be waiting on delays in both business and well in business or love or both um i kind of want to say business here for some reason it just seems like uh lots of business type stuff going on here um and that could very well be 
you know, also an easy way to confuse you or mislead you when you're trying to plan and prepare for an outcome in business or love. Um, but yeah, you know, because you need to plan and prepare for whatever the outcome is going to be. And always plan good, bad, ugly, all of it, but never sit there and hang on any one of them, any one of those scenarios fully you know go on with your life do what you need to do don't don't sit there and ponder but i feel like that's somebody i still feel like somebody's going to try to confuse you they're going to try to confuse you in work and business you know uh with your worth and whatnot so yeah just really recheck yourself throughout this whole week uh when especially when it comes to like business or work or something like that you know uh when it comes to finances uh, but in love, too. This Some of you could be love. You know, it could be love. Uh, you're waiting on a delay in love or something, and you need to plan and prepare for that. But still, somebody could be confusing you in that, too. Uh, at the end of the week, well, uh, it looks like you have, you're going to have an opportunity for a good investment at the end of the week. It's going to help you live more how you want to live. And I can't help but to think that this is all together you know you're you're going from accepting your worth working hard and then some kind of wait and delay happens in work or business and then all of a sudden uh an opportunity pops up a good investment um but i don't mean to just jump into any opportunity because we get offered opportunities all the time in life um uh, you got to go with your gut still and you still gotta you know uh figure out all the facts, make sure that it's actually a good investment, but there is a really good investment uh, for you at the end of the week. Uh, just, yeah, make sure to still do all the things you would do before you hopped into an investment. But I think, you know, you will know if it's a good investment or not. I don't think it's going to be something that's going to be that confusing or anything, but you just need to make sure not to jump into any and all opportunities. So, all right. Um, so yeah, uh, yeah. You're gonna be con you're gonna have confused and misled things going on uh, this week. But you need to remember that you do have worth. You have strong worth when it comes to your work, uh, whether that be an actual like job or that be like a, a self made business or whatever. You are worthy of that job of that. Uh, employment you know um yes there was going to be delays uh but also keep in mind you you know you know what the scenarios are going to be you need to figure those out and then not hang on them and then yeah keep your eye open for a good investment at the end of the week and don't let i still say there's a person uh maybe the tarot cards will tell us something more universe speak Spirit's Guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Well, whatever it is, you need to come at it gently. Strong, you know, very strong. But gently and use words, kind, you know, use the most gentle words that you can to subdue this beast. Um, and that's, see, that's what I think. There's a beast that you need to subdue. And I think this beast is who's ever causing this confusion and misled thoughts in your head. Uh, and I feel like when you figure out who it is, I mean, the cards, none of the cards came out. So this is all just me. But I just, that's what I felt the moment I pulled that card, is that it's somebody um, causing the confusion. And when you figure out who they are, you need to handle them with care. You know, you need to be strong, but you need to handle with care. Um, you have all the wisdom that you need to handle it with care. So, uh, there you go. I hope this resonated. If it did, hit that like button. And if you would, please comment, share, and subscribe. I hope to see you back here next week, and until then, stay safe, stay mindful, and stay healthy.